Guten Abend, das ist dein fünfter Teil Mailingen Moment. Good evening, this is your fifth installment of the Mailingen Moment. There's about five things I want to tell you, and all of them have to do with thanking the Lord and praising the Lord. You see, he said, I will build my church, and we've been praying for God to grow the church here, Heritage Baptist in Mailingen, uh, numerically and spiritually. So I want to praise his name. I want to thank him for the fact that we have seen seven, eight weeks in a row now where we've had visitors. Today, we actually had seven visitors, and the men, all of whom except one, uh, who couldn't, I'll explain that in a second, came back for Man Church tonight. We're very thrilled about Man Church. Uh, it is specifically to, obviously, evangelize and disciple men. I have never... Uh, taken part in or led a Bible study where men have been more open, uh, more uh, desirous not only to know and serve God, but to bring their peers along to know and serve God. Uh, so it's, it's not really anything new, amen, but it is uh, a tool that God is using right now. Uh, the one man who didn't come back tonight, he is one of the more encouraging visits that we have. He is from the West African country of Ghana. He's in Germany to further his education. He could not find a church, a Baptist church uh, near him. And so he took at least two trains and a bus and rode with a, a church member who met him at the train station uh, to get to church this morning. And he didn't come back for tonight because he had to travel back all that distance to the town he came from. But I mean, it was very encouraging um, to be there. And being Veterans Day, uh, one of our visitors was a, uh, a gentleman who is from Bavaria, which is a, another, no, he's from Heisen, uh, basically the next state over. Uh, from us. It's in Germany, but the next German state. Um, and so he's new to the area. And he came, but he came on Veterans Day, right? So the service was, we might say, very patriotic. And uh, he just ate it up. I mean, he was such a blessing. His name is Christian. He said, uh, after church, uh, uh, where is the, uh, uh, the booth for uh, to apply for a green card and citizenship. You know, I learned so much about America today. I mean, it was just, uh, just very lighthearted, uh, joy, a uh, joyful Christian. Uh, the, the, tonight at Man Church, he actually prayed and, uh, or he actually stated that the thing he was praying for was to be joyful. And I wanted to go, well, the Lord is answering that question because his lightheartedness really lifted my spirits after the service this morning. But, so we had those men come back from Man Church. We're really thrilled about Man Church. We are looking forward to late December when my wife and our two youngest children, uh, Nathan and Emma, are coming. And so then we hope to, at that point, start a meeting specifically for the ladies and one specifically for teens. And uh, uh, two of the visitors this morning were teenagers who are almost the same age as Nathan and Emma. So they were excited to know that Nathan and Emma were coming and uh, the parents have already planned to come back uh, Wednesday night. And uh, as I said, the, the men came to the meeting tonight. Um, the gentleman who has just moved here uh, from the Frankfurt area, uh, uh, his wife was home with their two-year-old and their two-week-old. Uh, but he said he planned to have his wife here the next meeting uh, the next Sunday. So, uh, you know, we've been praying for the Lord to grow the church. Uh, he's doing it, all right? Uh, seven weeks in a row, and the, the, today the culmination with seven visitors. Uh, God is working, and we're thankful for that. Uh, two churches I would like for us to pray for stateside. Uh, I try to pray for all of our supporting churches, but um, Shining Light Baptist in Starkville, uh, the Lord's working there. Not only uh, did they uh, help send us out, but they have another couple uh, that are, is getting ready to go. I think the term we should use is to 
a restricted country. Um, but uh, uh, just remember Shining Light. Remember Pastor John Harvey and the work there. I'd also like to pray for specifically for uh, Meadowwood Baptist Church, who is starting a men's ministry. In fact, the same one that we started uh, today. God's working there. And I know that, uh, um, let's just say Brother Lloyd's got some trials in his life right now and in the life of one of his children, and you could lift them up. Uh, I've been praying uh, for my older boys, and and uh, I just, I won't bore you with the details because I'm kind of rolling on six minutes here, so I should hush. But uh, let's just say God's working in the lives of my two older boys as well. God answers prayer, and don't you forget it. Auf Wiedersehen. Bye-bye.